This is absolutely horrible. Hey guys, welcome to another video of Creative Craft. Here comes my ask. Hey Slime, why did you start this video as you were finishing an iron farm? And to be honest, I don't know. I just felt like starting it right here. Like, I don't really want to show you guys me building this because, you know, I already built it last season. It's basically the exact same thing, but just with uh, some more ugly blocks. Yeah, I don't know why I chose to use pink glass. I just have some spare, so I decided to use those. And they do not match with the deep slate whatsoever, but that's beside the point. The point is, you know, uh, right now I'm trying to get this guy under this rail system, and it's kind of annoying to do that because my armor has swords on it, and I think if he punched me like two more times, we'll just die. So either I try to get this guy there, or just wait till the night again and get like another zombie, which is definitely possible. But of course, this episode is not about making farms. Well, I'm making an iron farm. Well, I have a little plan for my basic season. I'm going to make a giant quarry. Yeah, that will kind of need a haste to beacon. The easiest way to get a full beacon is to, you know, make us iron farm so I can get the iron, which is very easy to get because this farm is very efficient. Uh, before I get started working on my base, I'm also planning on making a shop at the shop industry. I don't think it's gonna take that long, but I guess we'll see. I don't have a shop yet, and I really want a good way to, you know, make money on the server. If you've watched my last video, you know, my plan is I'm going to make a copper shop for coppers. But then I realized, hey, uh, I don't think a lot of people on the server actually need copper. So I'm gonna basically make a, make a copper shop with a few other add-ons to it. Maybe some honeycombs, some, I don't know, iron from this iron farm, some candles, whatever. But yeah, I will wrap this up and I will see you guys. At the shopping district. All right, um, I'm in the shopping district right now. As you can see, I already start fitting in some blocks. So basically, uh, I'm gonna make my shop in like this area. I'm gonna uh, basically fill this whole area in with like a slab of grass, and I would, I would just get like basically a flat area over here for my shop that just overlooks down there. I think that'll be pretty good. So yeah, I'm just fill this in, and I can start the building. Alright, I've done some terraforming here, so basically, I just uh, covered this whole place with dirt and I also did some like, I, I put some stone and some like other blocks here for like those ledges where there's like really nothing there and it's the same for the other side as well, I also put some, some stuff here just because I think it would look cool and yeah, now since this area is completely flattened out, I can start building my shop All right, as you can see here, um, I already have this little pillar down. It might look kind of strange right now, but you know, uh, I'm definitely gonna make it look way better after I add in the thing that I'm gonna add on next. But yeah, uh, nothing on the inside is down, of course. I'm gonna do the inside last, like always. But the top part, uh, the pillar part is basically done. All right, I've cleaned up the scaffoldings. Let's get to the next part.
What are you doing up there? So, as you can see here, oh, uh, 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 get out of the way, I don't do anymore. Um, I have finished the front part of my shop, and well, you might say, hey slime, this does not look like a copper shop. Because, you know, there's only like a couple of copper over here, and like, what, like, are you done with the shop? Like, is this it? No, this is not it. And the best part of the shop that I think you guys will like a lot is gonna be next. In order to make the shop more, uh, more copperish, I guess, I've decided that I wanna put some copper gears on the shop itself and also some on the back as well and to be completely honest with you um i don't really know how to make copper gears so most of the copper gears design are like heavily inspired by images i found on google let's get to the building once again Alright, um, I'm going to quickly interrupt this replay because you guys might ask Yo, Slime, you made this bottom part, right? That looks pretty cool. It's a bunch of gears linked together. Where is the replay of it? Well, um, it actually got deleted. I, I don't know why it didn't save, but I just don't have the replay of me building this anymore. So I'm very sorry to all you guys. Um, yeah, I don't know how that happens. And there's no way for me to get it back, so I guess we have to deal with me not having that for this part. Yeah, sorry. Well, let's continue building. The exterior is done. And I will say it looks pretty good as of right now. Now all I need to do is the inside, and of course I need to restock my shop. So basically my plan here is, um, for this part I think it's gonna be like where I sell the copper. And like in here, I think I'm just gonna sell like a bunch of random crap that I have. Maybe like iron, because I have an iron farm, honeycombs, other things that I don't know yet. That's gonna be the plan as of right now. Maybe also red dye, because my iron farm also produce poppies. Also. Yeah, um, about the honeycomb, so let me show you guys. Fly over here, you see that's my drone farm that I built last episode. And I also built like a small bee farm over here, which gives me a bunch of honeycombs. I've been like AFKing a bit here and it gives me a lot of honeycombs and this is pretty good. And I'm, oh yeah, and speaking of that, I'm also planning to sell like honeycomb blocks maybe, and also like beehive. And I just realized I really need to light this up, it looks so dark outside and ugly. I have to like make it brighter. So I was making the interior of uh, of my shop and I got like a little work on it as you can see here and also like lit the outside up more and I got interrupted because I need to work on something else now for, for a very important thing because guess what? The shopping district looks um a bit too barren and unorganized right now I suppose and well like last season we're gonna elect another mayor to take care of the shopping district and I've been given the task to make like a mayor voting area like a little stage I mean I technically like volunteer to do it because I like building so I guess I have to hold the construction of my shop for now and start working on that because guess what the speech is tomorrow and I have to make something very simple for today so you know I will actually have something for tomorrow's speech so yeah I wanna see how it turns out. Let's get to the building!
What the heck? What is that? Bow chase? So basically, it's the next day and today is where... And today is when the speech is supposed to happen. So as you can see, I finished this yesterday and someone else placed a bunch of seats here. Was Chase, thank you Chase. Power 2023. I think that is, oh yeah, yeah, uh, that's definitely uh, the pause sign. Honestly, like, I don't know who I should vote here, but definitely not Chase. Because he just put a random sign at the river glade for no reason. I, I, I don't know why he did that, but that's kind of stupid. So, as you can see, we have uh, um, almost everyone here now. And the speeches for the mayor election is gonna start in very soon. And I'm very excited, actually, because I'm very excited on, like, how it's gonna turn out and what's gonna happen. And... Also, and of course, what everyone's gonna do when they're the mayor. Because, you know, the shopping district is, is pretty important. And I guess whoever is running should know that. So, yeah. All right. All right. Who's going first? Because I need to go eat Got dinner soon. So, uh, someone running. better volunteer. Under, you're Watch first. Oh, okay, cool. That's, that's, that's cool. Yeah, yeah, under. Let's go last yeah, the first. Under. Let's go Whip under. Sit. Whip Why sit. are we just don't stop? Why are you under even running? Sit down. Sit down. I'm t I just told you I'm like. Oh, my God. I can't. Oh. Ow. <laughs> I just said the server can. Guys, I'm taking a siege. There's like 90 people in the server. Oh my god, guys, I'm using a boy. Speech, 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 speech. Okay, put back the microphone. There were two microphones. Dude, I didn't the microphone. I heard to get rid of the nervousness, you gotta think of it get you to get naked. That's right. Oh, what? What's good with it? What's good with it? Oh, wait, no, it's actually, yeah, imagine you guys naked. Screenshot. <laughs> Boo! Yeah, come uh, on, bro. I got you. I got you. I got you. I got you. Okay. Can y'all hold up? Speech. Uh, Wait, pause. Where's the mic? Let him cook. Let him speak. Let him cook. Let him. Nepal, you see, you sound like you have asthma. Oh, uh, I you know. That's okay. okay. Hey, pause. Uh, speech, I can't wait to this up. I'm gonna go eat dinner in like one. Uh, place back the microphone. My fellow, today I plan to. Uh, do something yeah. that is in your best uh -huh. interest. Ooh. Now, nice. politicians usually get paid by people, so I am willing to accept any bribes. Ooh, politics. Yo, I got a. I got, three I got three weeks. Yeah, so I'm gonna kill this All man, right. bro. Politics. Okay. All right, let me get up there. All right, I now have a stick. Hey, you don't have the talking stick. Right. Now I, Calm I down, have guys. Now I have my confidence. Everyone sit down. Stick, dude. All right, fuckers, listen up. Oh, I'm a oh shut the fuck up, Chaser. I don't care that you're streaming. I don't care that you're streaming. I, I, you know what? If I become president, I am gonna ban all, all streamers. I'm gonna banish them to the the, the shadow realm. But I, um, but I also stream. Hey, stop hitting. fighting in the front row. Guys, whip, stop. I'm also gonna oh ban gosh. violence solely because he's wearing whip. armor. Ooh, he's being mm -hmm. me. Yeah, everybody take off their armor. Everyone get naked. Blue. Everybody get naked. That's also whoa. a new law. If any, so there's a group of more than six people, you all have to get naked. So. Yeah. Oh, whoa. Okay, yeah. I oh think I know who to vote for. <laughs> I like that rope. Yep, I'm voting for under. Okay. All right, guys. Uh, I say uh, our bedtime has to be no later than... Fucking never. There are no such thing as bedtimes anymore. None of you guys got any bedtimes. Yay! Let's I go! I hope you all eat ice cream after bed, after dinner time. And before dinner time, you're gonna <gasps> ice cream whenever you want. Now, granted, oh we don't have any ice cream. We only have potatoes. But if you squint your eyes really hard and imagine it, it's just ice cream. Hey! Hey! You don't have a fucking talking stick. It's the fuck that. Alright, who's also, throwing tomatoes way, at him? anybody dares to um, vote for anybody else, I will find them. I will find them. I won't, I'm not going to say what I'm going to do to them, but I, I'll, I'm just going to say that. I'm gonna, I'll find them. I like your big and just in case, um, you, know, that you don't have the talking we, stick. Even though it's never happened before, I'm going to assume that we all have a tradition to, you know, peacefully transition the power to the other person should I lose. Uh, I do not plan to do this. Um, so how long until January 6th? Okay, like six, five months, six months. What yeah. are you getting impeached? Mm, no. <laughs> <laughs> no. All right. Listen, listen. All I'm saying is you have two choices. You can either vote for me or oh you will vote for me. Man, I can kill you every time I want. Oh, I can vote for anyone else. That's a tough, that's a tough choice. Get Hang off, on, do you off. have the All right, who's next? Who's, who's next? next? No, but do you have the Yeezy sword? I do you, who's not. next? 
I was good with it. Okay, guys, guys, sit down, sit down, sit down. I was good with it. Oh my gosh. I know I'm the I'm one of the most recent members of Creative Craft. I may not be everybody's favorite, but god damn it, I'm my favorite. You're my favorite. You're my favorite. I know. I I know I might not be everyone's favorite member of Creative Craft, but god damn it, if I win this goddamn election, I'ma be the greatest damn member of Creative Craft y'all ever done had. I, yeah. wanna be like, I may not be the best, I may not be the worst, but god damn it, I'ma try my hardest. Uh -huh. Get naked. What's good with it, y'all? Guys, where are you? He listens to the people. Guys, I'm the district. God damn it, I listen the to helmet. everybody. All right, okay. everyone. Uh, take I just now. want y'all to vote for me because I am the greatest player of all time and I get all the b****s. <laughs> Oh, the true, people, the true. Teams. Prove it. There's one right in front of me. <laughs> <laughs> yo, <laughs> yo. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. <laughs> School shooter. <laughs> Whoa. Right, what yeah, did you all say? Right. All right. So I just want to say I hope y'all have a great day after this. I love every single one of you, no matter you do what. Good. Love you. Love you, Syndicate. Love you, Syndicate. Now my turn, guys. He's got okay, stage right. Oh my god, Marty, I didn't okay, know that you were here. Hi, Marty. Now, I just um, got here. as you can see here, ah, I'm trying to make room um, in my I got inventory. myself a microphone. And, um, here, have some trash. Yeah, I'm just going to be talking into this. Yo, boss. Basically. Okay, so. Yeah, have no room. As you, can, as you guys might know guys, from uh, shut up. people, uh, sh Slime, Marley, um, Paul, Syndicate, y'all know. In, in chaos, maybe. <clears throat> You all know last season the shopping district was a big mess, so I'm gonna fix that by ma adding Boo. paths. Kill, kill yourself. Um, and, and basically, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Please, and water, tree, water. Yeah, kill. Basically, I'm gonna add trees, and I'm gonna add a river, and get off the stage. Amazing, and, um, amazing. Love it, love it. Add stuff, and also I'm gonna ban Chase from the shopping district. Let's go. I'm kidding. And um, oh. yeah, I'm gonna build. I'm gonna build shops. Okay. And I'm gonna. Um, and I'm also I'm gonna ter terraform, making the grass look better, and add like cliff sides and stuff. I'm gonna add build. Uh, I'm gonna sell billboards, and I will add laws, and I will enforce them. Okay, never mind. <laughs> no, no, listen, not not any not anything bad. Uh -huh. However, if you, if your shop is not stocked for a specific amount of time, we can you know you, you can you kill know, you. Talk about boo it. boo. Get no, him off! Stop. Get him off! Boo! Stop! What? That's why he has to come. Boo! Back. All right, boy. You fumbled at if... the end, boy. No, no, no! Listen, I'm not done yet. If you haven't stocked your shop for a little bit and you don't want to stock it anymore, all right. Basically, if you want, you can sell it. You can stop. sell your shop, or you can sell the um. Please. You could sell your shop, or you could sell like the real estate of it, or you can you know do whatever you want with it. However. Um, if you can also buy specific plots and I will like make it for like the plot and I'll do everything so that way, you know, people know not to build there in case you have a shop that you want to build in the future. But like, you know, you don't have time to like, yeah. build it right now. So like you could buy purchase a plot depending on how big it is, you know, it'll pay and then that will go back into s other stuff and I'll give it to other people. Makes sense. Makes and that's, that's my, um, that's my speed guys so yeah if you want you can vote me yeah. cool. uh, somebody call no me, somebody call me um, um mickey d's grimace shack um like this guy and uh, yeah i think it's time i passed the talking stick that i've now lost down to someone else so yeah okay uh Let the polish man speak uh, and uh i think that you should vote for me during the mayor candidates and all that stuff the election um okay so i'm just gonna give you a list of why you should vote for me and the stuff that i'm going to do once I'll become the mayor, which I really hope that will happen. Uh, so first off, uh, reason why you should for me. I've been the vice mayor of shopping district in season one, so I've already got experience. You you, you yep. saw me try to do on season one, you know I'm trying my best. I tried my best, sadly there was nothing. Yeah, and I love your stuff in season one, by the way, I can vouch for that. Pristine microphone. I'm uh, sure there'll be plenty of shops and the incoming will be Table. Basically, I'm I'm saying that there will be no overpriced shop. So let's say somebody's selling I don't know dirt for I don't know five diamonds a stack. Then yeah, I'm getting rid of that shop. There's no way that's staying. And yeah, I'm also active on server, so uh, the accident from season one won't happen again. <coughs> Fire. Further. <clears throat> yeah. <clears throat> okay. Sorry. Uh, and now for the list of what I'll do once I win the vote. I will be making community projects in the area of the minigames district and shopping that's district. Mainly mini. Interesting. 
interesting. Eh? Yeah. Basically, the thing that I did, it will be basically the thing that I did on season one, which I'll make a board and then I will announce projects and we can just do stuff. Like everyone will be able to, like, you know, build their part to do anything they, they really want. So let's say, uh, for example, I wanted to make a road from shopping district to spawn in season one. Sadly, that didn't really work out, as I stated before, the server wasn't active at that moment. So, yeah, but it will be something like this. It will be either, I don't know, make a path, make a nice bridge, make make a mini game together. Anything really that could really benefit anybody. Um, obviously, make mini games and shops as separate districts. I know this was clear, but yeah. Uh, I'm gonna maintain the area by myself or with help, make sure that nobody will greet the place. Uh, however, if somebody does indeed damage and or slash steals from shops and minigames, they will be charged and action will be taken. And I'll expand on that later because when, when I become the mayor, because that will be just like, you know, the rules of, you know, the, the shopping district and the, the minigames district. Uh, I will build games and shops myself. I've already got a plan for minigame, so once I'll actually win as a mayor, I will be doing one of those as my first product to show off what I can possibly do. Next job. Uh, I mentioned that before, but I will make a set of rules on the terrain of shopping district and minigames district. So like no cheating in games, no copying others, so you know, n nobody could really, you know, do anything bad. Uh, I bring no harm, don't worry, make sure that everybody will be treated with the proper amount of respect, so no racism, no shit. I'm, I'm sorry, Ander, but that's how it's supposed to be. Hey, Don? Um, and and with help of someone uh, who knows I was not able to, to make them, look. I'll make banners of that will represent the shopping district and minigame district because, like, you know, we, we have to somehow show off what what is what. And uh, yeah, I think that's all really. Uh, thank yeah, you very much for. Good job. Whee! Well, definitely it was an interesting event. Since now the speeches are over, we can finally start voting for the mayors and the Paul made a little contraption here, I think it was the Paul. Basically, we have to uh, take a paper from this chest, rename it to the candidate's name and put it in this. I have a person in mind, of course. I'm going to vote for that person right now. The voting results should be uh, should be out by the next episode. Uh, since, you know, um, as of right now, it's gonna end Sunday. And well, of course, I'm not gonna tell you guys who I vote for. I'm just gonna vote and put it in there. I'm gonna cut. I'm gonna skip the part where I show you guys who I vote for. We'll just see what happens. I'll definitely tell you guys next episode after like the voting ended. I'm gonna keep it secret for now. And since I finish this stage and there will be no more distractions, I can finally go back. I'm working on my shop, which is almost finished. I just have to do a little bit of the interiors and then it should be done. So. See you there. The very simple interior is finally finished. I will just walk you guys through it right now. So um, in the first layer over here, it's, a big, it's basically just a little pond. You can swim up the water stream to go to the main shop part. If you don't have, a, if you don't have an elytra, of course, because if you have elytra, you can just fly in. And this is like the tree part of the shop where you can buy like more naturistic stuff like honeycombs, maybe wood, maybe other kind of stuff. And if you go over there, then you will see the other part and that's gonna be like basically the copper area where you can buy all the copper and maybe other stuff I don't know what I'm going to sell right here yet but of course as you can see um, this area is, is not done yet I still need to do some terraforming and make this area nearby just overall a bit nicer and as you can see I already kind of started over here but yeah so as you can see this area is very flat right now and well, I don't really want a flat area to be my shop because it looks very boring with just a huge plateau. So yeah, I'm gonna make do some terraforming and make it look way nicer. And I'm not going to replay this because it's kind of boring replaying because I'm just, I'm just gonna kind of figure out what I'm gonna do. And the terraforming is finally finished. Look at this. I'm gonna take you guys through the whole place. I basically made the ground like a, a, a bit more hilly with like moss and pozzo and cobblestone and oak uh, spruce mixed into them and also made a small tree over here which i think looks very nice and of course i also placed lanterns everywhere so i placed campfires everywhere trap doors slabs everywhere to make this terrain like more dynamic i guess and also leaves everywhere to make like it more bushy and I really like this. I think this looks very awesome. And I kind of make it a small pass that goes all the way up here. It's gonna be connected with like actual roads once like the mayor gets elected. And like, because I'm pretty sure the mayor, like whoever gets elected is definitely gonna like add in a main street or something to shopping district and we can link all the shop together. I still haven't given the shop a name yet. I think I know a name that I'm gonna give it to it. And of course, I'm gonna come my shop. 
the copper cod. And yeah, that's gonna be the name of my shop. I first have a shop on Great Craft Season 2. I definitely think this shop is way better than the shop like my life shop last season. And yeah, I think I did a good job on it, but what do you guys think? Do you think it's better than the live shop last season or do you think it's not? Because, you know, it's my own shop, I, I cannot really judge it that much. And with all of those settled, I think this is it for today's video. I finished my shop and of course I'm gonna start stalking it now and actually make some money. And yeah, hope you guys liked it. See you guys next time. Bye.